Hi, I'm Andrea Paul. Today we're going to be talking through one of the Board Vitals questions. This time this is a family medicine uh, question bank question. So I'll go ahead and read the question. It is a 45-year-old man with a past medical history of Crohn's disease. He's presenting with a recurrent rash that has lasted several years. Uh, this rash consists of lesions. They're scaly, silvery in color. They occur over his elbows, over his knees, and above his gluteal cleft, and they come and go over several months. Um, he never been able to identify any trigger, um, no fever, chills, nausea, you know, no other symptoms on uh, review of sy systems. Uh, his temperature is normal, you know, really his vitals are within normal limits, um, but the exam does um, show this silvery scaly plaque over his elbows and knees. Um, there's a photo shown in this question that should really um, help you figure out what this um, diagnosis might be. Uh, you also note that he has punctate bleeding when one of the scales is removed from this lesion. So the question is, what is the most likely diagnosis here? Um, options are psoriasis, pariasis rosea, contact dermatitis, miliaria rubra, or lichen planus. And so right away, the things that should stick out to you are the silvery plaque and the punctate bleeding when you remove part of the scale. And those are you know, classic buzzwords that will lead you to psoriasis. Um, so just a little discussion about psoriasis in general and what you might see in an exam question. So it's a chronic inflammatory skin disease. Um, it's characterized by well demarcated um, erythematous plaques with a silver scale. And so that's the classic finding. Um, they look very much like the picture in this question. Um, the most common type is chronic plaque psoriasis. And so um, this variant basically has symmetrical distribution. So you'll see it over both elbows or both knees um, in a really symmetrical uh, distribution with that classic, um, you know, sharply demarcated erythematous with the silver uh, scale. And so sometimes if they have put on like a lotion or an oil, that silvery scale will be, you know, look a little more erythematous and less white and silvery, but um, that's only temporary. So once it's dry, it, it'll have that same silvery scale appearance again. Um, they can really range in size, so you can have a one centimeter plaque or, you know, 10 or more centimeters in diameter. Um, usually asymptomatic, but some people do complain about itching or, um, you know, some pruritus around the area. Um, sometimes it can be painful if they have it on their palms and say that, you know, that's an area that they use a lot and it may crack, so there could be some pain um, or even disability from inability to, to use your hands if it, if it does get to that point. Um, so the classic thing, which is called Ovid's sign, is that when you peel away one of these silvery plaques, you'll have punctate, so little tiny dots of, of bleeding, like little pinpoints, um, and that's a really classic clinical finding, so that should help you find the answer in this question too.